Hello everybody, it's Andrea. Welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a while, you all know what's been going on, so... Um, yeah. This is going to be a very small haul. Um, I had some money left over from Christmas that my mum and dad gave me and after my dad's passing I just wanted to treat myself to a few things, so I did. It's been really hard the last few weeks, as you can imagine. Um, it won't be a weekly vlog for a while, I do, I, because we're still sorting out a lot of his stuff. There will be a reading vlog. Um, I'll keep you updated with how I'm doing my reading. I know you, some of you like those. But I just wanted to show you the few things I got in February. There probably won't be another one now for a good while. Um, so the first thing I got were these they're glitter pens. They're, they're from a company called Calm Over Chaos and I found them on TikTok, uh, a shop. And I'm just going to zoom right in. And they are very, very nice pens. I don't know if you can see how glittery they are here because it is quite... But they are very sparkly. They're really... Look, look at that. Really, really nice pens to use. They're not cheap. Um, they're not the most expensive, but they're not cheap. They, there's 12 pens in each one. You don't have a red, particularly. You have a pink. And I've got to be honest, I've almost used the pink up. The pink is absolutely gorgeous and they were 12 12 99 plus shipping so I'm going to be using these sparingly because like I said 12 99 plus shipping I can't afford to replace them but they are very very nice so they do have a website it's calmoverchaos.co.uk if you if you want to go over there and have a look they're really really nice really nice pens I also bought from their website, uh, from them on TikTok shop, the Stationery Island Brush Pen Set. Now, let's just zoom out a little bit because this one's bigger. These ones, they're just coloured water brush pens. They actually come with a water um, paintbrush so that you can make them more watercolour. So you can use them as they are, you can blend them, you can put water on them and make them look more watercolour. I haven't tried that yet, but I probably will. And they are very nice, this blue is lovely. Let me just show you that one on here. So they're, they're just beautiful brush pens. And again, they are 12 99 plus shipping, so. Now I have seen her blend with them, but I, I, I just can't. I'm not very good at blending anyway. Um, but yeah, so those, those, and they do look really nice. I've done a couple of pictures with those, so you'll see those in my completed pages, which will be coming very soon. The next, the next item you have seen, and that was the 72 set of the Amazon Basic Colored Pencils. I'm really enjoying these. I'm colouring a picture in Romantic Country 2, the second tale with these, which is a buddy colour with Molly. So I'm sorry Molly I haven't finished it. Obviously it was, I started it and then everything went to shit really and I just couldn't do very much. I have done a bit more since then and I have been colouring, but I, I just... It comes and goes when I feel up to actually doing things. But yes, I really like those. That's the 72 set. They were £19. Now, for £15 in the works, because they're on sale, is the 120 set of Crawford and Black. I haven't used these. I haven't swatched them. I want to do a video about them, but I don't really want to swatch 120 pencils on camera. It'll take forever. So they come in a nice, nice tin. The cat's having a sniff. we got a... I love the smell of them, I'm sorry. Um, and there's a good, there's three trays. Excuse my shaking hands, you've got lots of colours. Uh, like so. If you do want me to swatch the whole lot, let me know in the comments below. And I will do it. I'll just get it set up first with all the numbers and names and things. So that it's just a matter of colouring in the squares. So that was those. I'm really looking forward to using these. I've heard good things about them. So these are the ones I bought with the money that mum and dad gave me for Christmas. I've still got some of it left. Um, I did buy some books in the works as well, colouring books. Um, which you will see in a moment. Let's put those out of 
the way. Now on to the colouring books. Oops. I've got the Relax With Art issue 116, which is the newest ones. I, I do pick these up. I like the picture on the cover. I've got so many of these and I am trying to colour in them. Sorry, I'm shaking. As you can tell, I'm still not 100% right. Um, but I like this one, the Spanish Dancer. I think it's really, really nice. I am back on the Ava Brown launch team where they send you a colouring book, you colour a picture and review it on Amazon, whatever you want to do. Um, very cute. I've done two out of this one. Again, you'll see them on my finished pages. I like that one, actually. Um, that one's upside down, but never mind. Very sweet little book. I do find that with their books, the little mice get a bit repetitive, but they, they are still cute. And the second one I got as part of the launch team was Secret Village Spring, and I've done one from this. Again, I love this exercise in mouse. I think she's really gorgeous, and the kite flyers. So while I find the mice repetitive, the pictures are really cute. So, oh, excuse me, it's not that bad. It could be a lot worse. I got the new Jade Summer book just because I wanted to have it. Now it's a hundred bold pictures coloring book. So it's simple designs for adults and kids, and they really are. They're, it's really like a kids coloring book for toddlers. But I just thought when I'm a radish and a peas, when I'm feeling really bad, I can just come and colour in here. I can practice blending in here with my pencils if I want to. I can let Jennifer colour in it. But. They're really simple, but they're really cute. I like the cupcake. It's not something I'd normally buy, but giraffe. I love giraffes. I did just want something really simple to colour. Because I feel like colouring, but everything's a bit overwhelming, as you can understand at the moment. So I'm finding it a bit difficult to colour mad things. I'll do a flip through of this if you want. And show you. There's only two more books, like I said, I didn't get much. And these are the two that I bought with the, my, bit, my Christmas money from Dad and Mum um, from the works. The Occult and Folklore Colouring Book by the Duchess of Law. Absolutely gorgeous. Nice thick pages, although it's double-sided. It will probably take water mediums quite well. Look at that. So I'm never going to colour that one. That's just too mad. They are... That is really cute. And that one, the, the double page of the unicorns is really nice. And the other one I got was the tarot colouring book. I got about three or four tarot colouring books. I just love them, I pick them up. And again, not as thick this paper, but it's still thick enough to take a uh, water colour if you wanted to use watercolour or ink tents. And you've got picture of whatever it is this is about the minor arcana cups and then on the left you've got what it's about and the same with the major arcana so here we've got the moon gorgeous picture there and then on the side what the card actually represents it means the tower death wheel of fortune the hierophant the emperor etc gorgeous little pictures and i like the way they have put on the other side the um what it's about so and that that's pretty that's all i got in 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 february i've had no color in heaven so the latest ones have not inspired me to pick them up at all that magic jars was the last one the pocket one which i really did like um but if you want to see me coloring any of these please just let me know i will be doing a color and chat as soon as i can so i really hope to be back soon it's literally going to be how I'm feeling at any one time. So for instance, today I'm all right, it's not too bad. Yesterday I couldn't stop crying. Um, it is what it is, it's grief, and I know I've got to deal with it. Um, but we've still got a few few practical things to sort out. But I do want to come back and make videos for you all, because he would have wanted me to, because he was amazing. So I'll see you all in the next one, and I hope you enjoyed this very small haul, and I'll see you soon. Bye, everybody.